Hi, and welcome back to the Mr. Brad Warren Show. And now that I'm done with the crazy trouble bubbly, I figure since I have some peppers around, I may as well start some pepper training. So if you are a chili head or you know the different kind of heat levels, people get tolerance to different things. So there are some people who get tolerance to like challenges and capsaicin. There's some people who get tolerance to tinctures and some people who get tolerance to hot peppers. So a while back after my tincture and capsaicin training, some of my levels of tolerance were very, very high, but peppers is a whole different beast. So some of my friends in the Chile High community, like uh, the Pineappler and Tomas and a few others, have really been kicking in the hot pepper eating. And uh, as for me, not so much, a little bit here and there, one of my mystery bags, a couple of my mystery bags, I had a few hot peppers, and that was a few. So a while back, I was trying to beat the world record for most jalapenos in a minute. That was probably over a year ago, so you can go back and look for that if you'd like. So I did several rounds. The first time was kind of a fail. Then I found some smaller ones just within the range, and I think I only got eight or nine in a minute. The record's like 16, which is like almost going to be impossible. That record stood since the early 2000s, I can't remember, like 2003 or 2004, so that one's going to be super hard to beat. Well, anyway, I thought I'd start out with some weaker stuff and get hotter. It's not going to be like the Trouble Bubble Challenge days where, uh, where, uh, I eat peppers every day necessarily. I might be throwing in a few other things this week, but I am gonna try and work on my pepper tolerance. So this is what I have left for jalapenos. And jalapenos um, for chili heads aren't super hot, but for an average person, if you watch back to last week, awesome sauce trying to eat one, jalapenos for an average person, if you eat a whole one, it can give you a burn. If you're an average person out there watching, they come at common grocery stores, Pick up a jalapeno or two and try them and see see what it does. But I have nine jalapenos. These are not the small ones either. These are like huge, big, fresh, like hand size. I mean, these are big jalapenos. Uh, ripe and hot, I found out last week a little bit. Hot for jalapeno. So I'm going to try and eat all nine just to try and train my tolerance a little bit on the peppers and then work my way up. I have all kinds of peppers waiting for me this week. So I guess I'll get to it. It's not time, but I'm probably going to try and get through pretty quick so I don't bore you. Oh. I have tons of seeds it's in them too. first jalapeno. The seeds are already starting. After the first bite, and the heat's already starting too. Oh, that's a lot of seeds. <clears throat> oh, yeah, it's totally full up here. The heat's really built already. Really don't know. <clears throat> but maybe I'm going to make it through the bowls and make it through all nine, but. <clears throat> It's just the jalapeno. It's like the weakest hot pepper in the world. There's some that are a little weaker, a little man fire, but pretty standard. How is something weaker than a jalapeno? <clears throat> Second jalapeno. Number two. Check out late for work too. They did the balls of doom this morning. The Balls of Doom was a nice challenge. Um, I was going for with Balls of Doom for uh, heat and uh, flavor being good, and I think I accomplished that. <clears throat> if you are interested in the Ball of Doom, you will have to let me know in the comments. <clears throat> Life of Work also tried out the Sour Pickleball Challenge too today. Just so I could done watching that one. Awesome Sauce loves that one. That one phases her. But it was tough for me. You got three quarters. You three that one wasn't hot yet, yeah, but now quarter. I'm hitting the massive amount of seeds. And seeds are, you don't know, 
season the pepper amp it up yeah. toward the stem part at the top. <clears throat> It's like a mouth of seeds. It's probably getting pretty hot now. Mm hmm. They taste good. I mean, they taste pretty good. I'm at about a two, but I don't know if my stomach is gonna like all this later. A two for a chili head? Mm -hmm. Like a two for a chili head. Average person probably had ten by now. Hey. Do you finish this jalapeno? You'll be a quarter of the way done, and you'll only have two quarters left. Three plus three plus three equals nine. <coughs> Third, you mean? Be a third of the way done? Yeah. Oh man. These are so big and they are so seedy. Where'd you get these? I don't remember where I got these, but they're fresh, they're ripe, they're big. They are hot. And they're hot for jalapenos. Hotter than most I've had. Did you get my passport? I don't remember for sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, you're a third of the way done. We're jalapeno. I mean, jalapenos taste good to me. I like them. I like to eat them. I like to put them, put them on stuff. Usually I don't eat this many. And when they do those chili head competitions or do the jalapeno competitions, yeah, and um, a lot of times they'll do the peppered ones, and the peppered mm -hmm. ones are a lot easier too. <coughs> they're not as crunchy, and they're also not as hot if they pickle them or they. Almost two thirds of the way done. The eat my mouth isn't so bad, but my stomach doesn't feel like it's liking it. So it's more of probably tolerance for my stomach more so than it is heat up top because pretty much that is solid. The heat's probably in the bottom more than the top. Two to three for I mean it's it's a solid heat for even for chili head. It's like a two to three. Pro it probably settled about there. Jalapeno. Which means I'm halfway there after this one. I think, right? That's three and a half. That's yeah. Even the small ones are packed with seeds. That's three and a half quarters done. Actually, this is two and a half quarters done. Seven jalapeno. I think I was only number six. Oh yeah, seven, eight, One more quarter uh, left. Mm. Uh. You can do it. 
Is Mr. Bread Warden going to even finish? Huh. <clears throat> the eat on north is not that bad with the <coughs> stomach. Sorry. It's staying hot and it's staying full because I just ate supper not that long ago. Oh, oh Mr. Warden, are you going to finish? I'm going to try to. Drop the one seeds. seeds. Mm. Yummy. Again. I did not think I'd enjoy eating that many peppers. Mm. You're on your seventh pepper. Maybe eat the the smaller one, and then. I may have to eat them all anyway. That was the goal. Nine. This one is huge. This one is like. Another huge one. It's like Schwartz of pepper. Ah. Here's your eighth pepper. I think the first two are bigger <coughs> than this one, but this is one of the bigger ones that were on the table. You're right. <coughs> Imagine making jalapeno poppers with those. Mmm. That'd be good fun. Those would be some spicy All you have to eat is one. Those would be some spicy jalapeno poppers. These are huge jalapenos. I mean, they're huge. They're much bigger than the average time. Probably yeah. two times bigger. Yeah, if you make jalapeno poppers. poppers with those things, you would be having huge. Or did you get it at the Mexicano grocery store? I don't know, but these are some of the largest jalapenos I've, I've seen. And not only that, but some of the hottest ones I've eaten, too. I can't remember where we got them. It's got to be in one of the two places. Mm. Okay. Mm. I want to see even maybe oh, the Mexicano grocery know. store we got them at. Last well, one's not super big. Because they had some really big peppers there, too. That pepper is like... Oh, my goodness. Are you going to be able to do it? Your eyes look glazed over. Mm -hmm. And it's not even, like I said, it's not even enough. He don't notice, it's like, it's oh my clues. You're gonna get me a snack and be happy with me tonight. Well, the heat's probably, the heat, ever that last one, that was a hot one. For chili hot after all these, and probably send that about a three. I think somebody did say that peppers train your stomach tolerance. Probably. We need to eat more peppers more often. Oh, right, yes, it's good. I'm not sure my stomach won't even get Not raised. so hot, none. But the ammonia is crazy too. I think one pepper is equivalent to like two or three little peppers. That's true. This was almost like eating like two or three times as many. These jalapenos were two to three times bigger than your average one. So. These jalapenos are like a. That's a lot of jalapeno. Guess um, what? These jalapenos would probably be equivalent to like. Four slimers or something. Like as Not big. Sure. Like as big as oh, four slimers. Oh, I just think it's fresh. Okay. Maybe that I get it. Okay. All right. So, <clears throat> if you've never tried, if you're an average person, and you have never tried to eat a jalapeno pepper, and you're watching, okay. I challenge you to do that. You can always stop when you get done. Awesome sauce tried. She almost downed one of these big ones. Almost got through the whole thing. Little man of fire tried ones. Got a few bites off, maybe like half of it before I got the seedy part and was done. They do get hot when you eat them straight. Now for chili out they aren't that hot, but the tolerance training was eating the multiples here. Um, 
and it was good training. So, oh, oh, my stomach's not even gonna know what to do with this. And I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do with it either. But anyway, this is some good pepper training here. Jumbo jalapenos. And we will see you next time on the Mr. Red Warren Show.